This is a how-to video. We had a shed that the foundation bust across the door frame, basically kept the door from working. So we hired a structural engineer, and it was way too expensive. It works and fine. Right here, it she went on the fish. It happened last summer. So I decided to start, just go ahead and do it myself. I built, drilled some uh, piers and a post hole digger, a tractor, dug them out deeper. And, uh, of course, we got icy and frozen over. I had to stop working a few, few times. Anyway. What are you doing over here, Daddy? Well, I'm digging a pier for the foundation. foundation After I got the, duck, the holes dug, I put in some 3H rebar. And uh, here's a little diagram of what I did. Used some high-strength concrete. Mixed it up. In a little tub, poured it in the hole. While that was curing, I went to the shop, bought me some bolts, some grade eight bolts, and I uh, built me some stands and uh, painted them up so they wouldn't rust. Coated them with grease. Bought me a jack. It's a twenty ton jack. It's only six and five eighths inch tall. Slipped it underneath the concrete and I put a angle iron on there so. I wouldn't crack the concrete. I wasn't sure. It really didn't have a footing. It's just a little shed. When I got done, I put the plastic, you know, some PVC pipe around the, the jacks so the mud wouldn't make them rust any worse. And I did it on all of them. And right here, you can see the door opens now. It didn't open for the last two years. So I was real proud when that happened. Well, right here I'm putting some elastic caulk into that crack just so the bugs can't come in through that crack into the shed and uh, just help seal that concrete. You notice that concrete is pretty level now after I leveled it. It, it was uh, the grade was enough that you could trip walking through there. So I bought two ro uh, two two stalks of this of this caulk. There it is, pretty level. You notice there's no grade change. So we're going to pour gravel around our stand that the foundation is sitting on. I've and finally, I just uh, bought some pea gravel, some rock, poured it in around the stand just so if I do have to adjust it, since the piers are not going down to, to a load bearing strata, I may have to go in there and, and crank up on those bolts a little bit tweak it a little bit so I put rocks in there just to make it easier and right here you can see the lift there's actually a crack between the dirt and the shed foundation 